Nicodemus here from eve-social.com with another guide for beginners. Today's guide is on EveMon and EFT or PIFA. I'll be using PIFA, but it's pretty much the same thing except for I like the user layout of PIFA more. So first of all, we're going to download EveMon. If you watch the beginner guide on bookmarks and programs, that it is in the video description. I will also add it to the video description here. Okay, so we're going to go to Evma, and this is a character, Don Smurf. Yes, he was a character on the Smurfs. Uh, this is a character I just set up for this guide. Okay, so. First thing we're going to do is we're going to add an account. It's going to ask for user ID and API key. To get your API key and user ID, you're going to click on this link. And it's going to bring up your login. And you're going to log in. Once you log in, you're going to come to a screen with your limited access API key you're going to create a new one if there's not one generated there. You're going to take your user ID and your API key and you're going to copy and paste them into this and click next. Once you do that, it's going to tell you to select your characters. You're going to put a check mark if they're not already check marked into the characters you want to select. your character should be up here, up at the top here. So now, uh, we're going to be working with Don Smurfo. Um, let's create a new plan. The name for this plan is Mining Op. You click OK, and you're going to see a blank plan queue. This is to uh, what this is doing is we're going to create a plan for your skill planning of your character. So, next, um, we could, you know, in mining, we're going to want to get to uh, Hulk. But if this is your main character, you're not going to go want to go to Ship Browser, go straight down to Examiners, or and click on Hulk and add to plan. Because in that 51 days, 18 hours, 2 minutes, and 55 seconds, I'm sure you're going to be wanting to do something with your time. So we're going to set this up in stages. And also, this Hulk is not fit. It has none of the fittings. Obviously, you can go to Item Browser, add the fittings individually, but that's going to take a long time. So what we're going to do now is... We're going to open our fitting tool, in this case, PIFA. So we're going to plan that initially we're going to want a cruiser. And I chose a scythe initially for my mining, because it's got mining bonuses. And we're going to throw together a quick fit. Put you know three minor two uh, three minor twos on it, expanding cargo hold two. Um, you're obviously going to need more. Let's see if I can import. I think I. Size set up. There it goes. Oh, that is really old. Back when it still had a Sibby on it. Alright, so uh, this is just an example. We don't need to actually fit out a full ship. So let's go to, um, let's go ahead and copy that to clipboard. 
copy to clipboard using EFT. And we're going to, in our plan queue lining up, we're going to do an EFT import. It's going to say time for selected loadout, 3 days, 12 hours, 24 minutes, and 42 seconds. Let's go ahead and add that to plan, tell you what it's adding. And you can set it up with priority, priority 1. Because that's going to be the first ship you're going to mine. Well, probably not. You're probably mining in whatever you have if you're going to be a miner. So, but that's going to be your first uh, miner with any type of power. So, now we have a three day, 12 hour, 20 minute queue. The next um, we're probably going to want to get into is a retriever. So, I do have some retriever setups. One fit for a shovel. This is just a simple setup. Um, as you can see, the CPU usage is going to be pretty high on this. I probably wouldn't have a small shield booster there, especially not a Tech 2 one. We can't change that out real fast if we want to. Let's do a survey scanner. Let's put a survey scanner there. All right, now. Obviously, these circles mean we do not have the required skills, red skill book, but we're going to go ahead and copy this plan. Um, go to two clipboard, EOT, let's go to EFT import, add to plan, and we'll go ahead and that looks good to me. Okay, let's close, and now that isn't your plan. Notice now we have a 12-day plan. 12 days, 14 hours to get into a retriever. Now, either you're going to go straight to Hulk from retriever, or you're going to take the next step, which is Coveter. Um, for this guide, we're doing a um, plan, a setup plan. So, we're going to go ahead and go into a Coveter. Just for giggles. Uh, this, since we're going to be fitting the coveter pretty much like the retriever, I'm just going to go ahead and go to ship browser here. Uh, let's go to mining barges. Go to coveter. Uh, let's go ahead and add this to plan. There you go. That's going to increase your skill queue by quite a few days. Now, next what we're going to do is we're going to go to Exhumers and we're going to go to Hulk, which we have no fits on. So, let's go to Hulk fit. That's fine. And we can start setting up what we're going to do our Hulk. Or, we can go to Battle Clan. And let's find some hulks that are already decently fit. And this way we'll, you know, uh, get a beginning idea to import. If we have to edit it, we can edit it in Python. So let's go ahead and do this. Loadouts. There's a retriever. Hulk. Ship. Um, Hulk. Let's go to a high setting zoomer. Let's see how they got it fit up. Yeah. That's not perfect, but it'll work for the guide. We could always, you know, change things um, if we would like to. So let's go to export. Let's copy this. 
this. Let's go to just this is just to save in Python. So we're going to go from clipboard. So we have it saved, so we can edit it, change it, see the right here, CPU usage and such. Um, we're definitely going to have to uh, do some skill training here um, to set this up, obviously. So let's go to, to clipboard. And now notice, when you first get your Hulk, um, you can always set it up with your modular instrument monitors that you already have. Um, probably wouldn't put cap rechargers there at all. Um, I would probably do one mining laser upgrade and one cargo hull expander. Depends on if you're doing an op with. If you're doing it with Orca to store your cargo, do two mining laser upgrade twos. If you're doing it um, by yourself, you want kind of AFK mine, watch a few episodes of your favorite TAE show, um, put the cargo hull extenders on, set up your location, start, you know, killing roids. So, now, we're going to go over to EFT import again. I'm going to add to plan. You know, we Yep, we're currently there. So, exhibitors one, two, three, mining five. That's going to set some days to our plan. All right, now we're going to close plan Q. Now it gets you a comprehensive so you can be mining throughout. Now, if you want to be running missions until you get your Hulk, you could always change out, you know, your beginning site or. Um, retriever coveter for your mission running ships and then put a hulk at the end. Um, I used a frigate into level ones, a cruiser into level twos. Um, I'm running level twos right now with a battle cruiser, except for during ship restrictions, um, which is a little bit overkill. But like I said, you could set it up to where you could be running missions while you're waiting for your hulk. Um, it's up to you and what you want to do. But this guide is basically to set you up to where you can uh, create a comprehensive skill plan in stages using EVEMON and your tools. If you're using EFIT, uh, let me say this before we go, um, you import the same way. Um, actually, with the EFITting tool, it automatically... When you copy something, it automatically um, knows that there's text. It has um, something built into the program that scans for data. And then you can set it up here. And then you click on this little ship icon, copy the clipboard, and that's how you import it into EVEMON uh, using this example. All right. So I want to... Thank you for your time. Um, there will be future tutorials, um, but this is to kind of get you started. Have a good evening.